He's back, everybody, in the kitchen. Chef West Step from Red Sky Cafe down in Duck, North Carolina. We have missed you, my man. Where have you been? I was supposed to be up here during the Outer Banks week, uh -huh. but I ended up having to go to San Diego. Sweet. Yeah. Very and, nice. Um, so anyway, it was a great time, uh -huh. but uh, I'm back. and You are back, and you brought something back from the West Coast. What are you doing for us? Well, we also have it on our lunch menu. We've done it for years, but I'm going to goose it up with a little East Coast fish. We're going to do a little, and you know what that is. That's a fish. That's a fish. That's that is a, a fish fish. That is a fresh tile fish. I got tile it. Tile fish. Nice. Yep. Got it right across the bridge. Carowan Seafood just came in yesterday. Um, so basically, I'm going to clean that sucker. And we're going to do like three different sauces and all local ingredients. and Fish tacos, right? Fish tacos. And you're going to clean that on Air Force, right? Yes, sir. Beware, everybody. <laughs> we're cleaning fish here on the Hampton Road Show. We'll clean them in just a moment. Welcome back, everybody. We're in the kitchen with the one and only West Chef, uh, Chef West Step from Red Sky Cafe in Duck, North Carolina. He's wrapping up his fish tacos. I think I got your name mixed up somewhere in there. That's all right. You are West Step, correct? I am West Step. Okay, you've got three pans of cooking over here. I do. It's time to cook. We uh, clean in the first, cook in the second. Yep, and I've got a little bit of tile fish going right now. You can see how white it's getting real quick. I'm, I put it Pretty. in there, what, about a minute, minute ago? Yep. I'm going to cook all of it because... Any of you Shriners over there want to try some tile fish tacos right. at the end of this thing? They've got their uh, seafood festival Saturday, but we're having our seafood festival today. today. And I also trade fish tacos for candy. So, ah, <laughs> you think we, you could take, tackle that gummy bear? I don't know. I've tackled a few I bears in my day. Care. I can barely carry it so big. I don't know if that fit on my tastefully fit stuff, but I no. think it's a good free day type thing. That's okay. It's, yes. It's an indulgence. It's a, it's a wonderful Pop rock. Thing. So anyway, we got our fish going. Yep. I got three pans going. Yep. I'm going to cover that sucker, and I bet by the end of this thing, it'll be ready. Uh-huh. Uh, you asked me what kind of spice I put on this. I yeah, I was going to say, I, I, for, I don't know. I, for some reason, thought of Old Bay, but it's not Old Bay. No, it's not Old Bay. What it is is just like blackening spice or Cajun spice. I used uh, about six or seven different kinds of peppers, cayenne, white, black, kosher salt. Um, look at it. Now, I protects my fish. It crusts it a little bit. It's also going to season it up. Mm -hmm. That sucker is almost done. This is All, too easy for you. This is kind of easy. This is too easy. For I you. usually do like four or five things. Yeah, I know. I, He's just, just What are we going to talk about, Chris? What are we going to talk about? Outer Banks. Well, I mean... Uh, you're coming down next week. You know I'm, that the I'm fall is like premium. Well, here, you were time. saying, you, I know you say the fall is, but right now you said you've seen a big difference between last week and this week, mm -hmm. the drop off in tourists, because kids are getting ready to go back to school in North Carolina. Next week. Right. On Monday, we've lost a lot of our employees and mm -hmm. stuff like that. A lot of people are going back to college. Um, but, uh, you know, the business kind of also goes down a little bit as well. You know, a lot right. of Plenty of room to stretch out on the beach without having neighbors next to you. You got it. And, uh, and also, the water is beautiful. You got the fishing's getting really good. Like you said, next week you're looking for the fishing. Mm -hmm. uh, the surf will be good. The water is warm. My wife likes to go down there and get some back to school stuff. Oh, yeah. They're, they're giving it away down there. Well, the retail shops are ready. Uh huh. Where do you guys go shopping down there? Just different places? Where do we what? go? Yeah. Shopping? Yeah. Well, always got to go to the go Alamo. Got to go to the Alamo, all right? Yeah, you got to go you there. Guys like the surf shops, though. Get a little surf gear. Yeah. Okay, so listen now. Susan says we have a picture of you. Susan. Boom. Oh, yeah. That's my nephew. That's Jacob, right? Yeah. That's Eric Jacobowski. Yep. He just Eric? graduated last week. Eric. Yep. Okay, Eric. Proud of you, Eric. That is awesome. I tell you what, too, the Good ceremony day. and everything like mm -hmm. that, I'd never been to, you know, anything like that. It was really awesome out there. It makes you proud to be an American. Thanks to all our guys for their service, all branches. And look at that. We just heated those things up. You can make these at home. Now, if you've gone out and you've indulged a little bit with the sweets, you know what I mean? Yep. You can have a fish taco. And you can make it just as healthy as you want to make up for some lost ground by adding all these different things. I've got goat cheese, jalapenos, the mango salsa. I've got fresh pico de gallo. The tomatoes come from Curry Tuck. Okay. You'll pass his place on the way in right before you get to the bridge. Right. Mr. Malco, I get from local Woo, farmer. Look at that. Very nice. Bang. Okay, so you have one minute. Can you plate a taco in a minute? Can I plate a taco in a well, minute? Got it not. Boom. I'm going to put you to the test. One taco in a minute. That's like eternity for you. I got to use my hands. I know. We got the taco in there. Yep. I'm going to hit it with a little bit of fresh cilantro. I'm I like the blank bean corn salsa. We'll turn it off for you, Chris. I do not want you getting burned before your trip. We're going to go with a little guacamole. And I'm doing a cilantro stung slaw, which oh, has no nice. mayo in it. Bang. And then to kick it up a notch, what? 
Did you say something <laughs> over there, Stephanie? Uh, <laughs> is that an aioli? That is a sriracha aioli. So sriracha, Thai garlic chili paste made with a little homemade mayonnaise. Boom. Let's hit it with some goat cheese. Damn. Okay, and you can get that uh, on the lunch menu every today day at, West Ca at Red Sky. Every day at Red, Red Sky, Sky Cafe. Cafe. Red Sky Cafe, everybody, in case you didn't know, and if you've never been there, it is open daily at 1197 Duck Road in Duck, North Carolina. It's right there on the right, right across from the water. Beautiful view. Call them at 252 261 8646 or look them up online, redskycafe.com. You'll be glad you did. And then when you go in there, tell Wes you saw him here on the Hampton Road Show. Sounds good. Good Take to have you back.